Romano, Prodi's direct and bittersweet experience of trying to rebuild Italy's economy. His second coalition government ended after two years in 2008, now days before the polls. He says the priority is to step up the fight against red tape and criminality. Now, President Prodi, you've been following the campaign very closely and the prospects for the new government. What reforms would you say are most important for them to pursue when they're in office? The reforms are to have foreign investments fighting against criminality. That's, you know, because you have so many choice of our investment. So when I, I look at business, why invest in Italy? You have these problems. Second, tax evasion, because otherwise you never know what, how to behave. But the most important is bureaucracy. The injustice in uh, giving uh, permission for building in, you know, uh, we have a bureaucracy that uh, plays against uh, uh, the progress. It's not the problem of reforming the law, it's the problem of reforming the behaviour. But of course the Monti government lost momentum, didn't it, towards the end. People worry that the impetus for the reforms has slowed down without a real economic crisis and vested interests will head the reforms off. Sure, but the Monti government was backed by three parties that had a completely different platform. We need a clear majority, not an emergency government.